Day of morning cut short when someone fired shots into a funeral home today. Thank you for joining us here on the night team. I'm Haley Minogue. Newcomer funeral home in Valley Station boarded up their windows today after the shooting left two people hurt. The night team's Tom Lally explains. Here at Newcomer Funeral Home, we actually saw several people come up for the services they were expected, but they told us everything was canceled today and they'll have to come tomorrow or later in the week. Shots fired in the main funeral room. Bullet casings fill the parking lot and broken windows show what could have been a deadly scene at this place of mourning. LMPD says shots were fired on the parking lot. One person shot and another hit by debris. According to LMPD, they're expecting both people to live. And boy, there's a mail truck out front. That truck stayed on scene for hours. We reached out to the United States Postal Service who told us a postal letter carrier was there and received minor injuries. The latest in a difficult year for postal workers in Louisville. One robbed and threatened with a knife in July. Another robbed at gunpoint in August and now this. An officer with the postal inspector investigating at Newcomer Funeral Home, which has seen crime tape before, but nothing like this. In the past 15 years, LMPD responded to 16 crimes here. Theft, vandalism, aggravated assault, weapons violations, and burglary. Now, this shooting shattering what should have been a day to mourn and move forward. Tonight, police are still looking for the person or persons responsible for this shooting. In Louisville, Tom Lally, WHAS 11, on your side. In a statement, Newcomer Funeral Home said their thoughts are with those that have been affected by today's events and their families. We hope the people who have been injured make a quick and full recovery. We're thankful for LMPD's quick response. Newcomer is fully cooperating with authorities and will have no further comment at this time.